Hey YouTube, JW. Got another edition of Retro Knives for you today. Today we're going to be looking at um, a Gerber fixed blade, actually two Gerber fixed blades. And uh, kind of to set the table here for this, I'm going to show you some brochures that I received with one of these knives. It is some Gerber pamphlets, brochures from the 80s. This is 984 there. Um, here's the first knife we're going to look at. Gerber's popular camouflage series. A400 hunting knife with jungle leaf camouflage handles and scabbards. And I also have another brochure here. And uh, that would be for this one. So, minty Gerber fillet knife. Very nice. Okay. <clears throat> there it is. <clears throat> this one is the more of the hunting fixed blade knife. They did have the Gerber Guardian and the Gerber Guardian uh, boot knife and the Mark series, which were also in the jungle camouflage pattern. Um, and, and they are really, really hot right now. Very collectible. Um, this one I bought in a lot. As you can see, it's uh, I worked on this blade heavily. And you see me in the uh, Strop Madness video. It's, it's very, very sharp. I mean, it'll little slice paper pretty good you can see that mirror edge on there but uh, there are some nicks and deep scratches in this blade that uh, I can't get to come out some rough spots there on the edge but hey it's a working knife you know um, it's kind of it's got a heavy kind of metal type handle and then it, it's coated with this camouflage grippy type material really cool looking camouflage pattern and then you've got the matching uh, type uh, canvas type ballistic can uh, not nylon but I guess it would be canvas old school sheath locks in the place not the greatest, but uh, it's old. Classic 1980s Gerber. Uh, really, there is no stamps on this blade. What the paperwork says. Uh, I'm assuming that this knife was, <clears throat> was made in. Uh, 1984, 85, probably in Portland, Oregon, in the USA. Let's say. Let's see, there's this one on the bottom, and then there's the tactical one on the top. Um, a lot of these older Gerbers like this were made, some were made in Japan, some were made in Portland, Oregon. Um, they're both bringing premium money right now. And uh, like I said, I got this one cheap and I'm just gonna hang on to it because the blade's not that great, but uh, it 
sharpened up real nice and uh, the handles are in very good condition. So, which is kind of strange. Somebody must have just beat the blade up because you would think that, that the uh, handles would be worn from use. But uh, anyway, a really cool knife. One of my favorites. Um, <clears throat> any camo, vintage camo knife, I'm a fan of because it just reminds me of just got that styling look that you just don't see anymore and uh, another classic retro knife design this is the Gerber A400 hunting knife with the jungle leaf camo pattern circa about 1985 thanks for watching